Welcome to Down to the River with Pastor Adam from Oglesby Union Church. Down to the River is a fast five minutes to drink in some of the living water given to us by Jesus through studying His Word, the Bible. From Oglesby Union Church, here's Pastor Adam. He pitched the perfect game, 27 strikeouts. He bowled a perfect series on 900. They had a perfect season, undefeated, and won the Super Bowl. Their horse won the Triple Crown, the Preakness, the Belmont, and the Kentucky Derby. He never lost a boxing match. We even have perfection in the church. We used to give out pins to those who had perfect attendance, never missing a Sunday in a whole year, 52 in a row. And we even stress the memorization of Scripture to say it perfectly without missing a word. Perfection is sought after, and we post it so others can see it on YouTube. But what about perfection before our God? An expert of the law asked Jesus this question in the Gospel of Matthew. Teacher, which command in the law is the greatest? To say it another way, what command do we follow to reach perfection in God's sight? Jesus said to him, Love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind. This is the greatest and most important command, and the second is like it, love your neighbor as yourself. All the law and the prophets depend on these two commands. Now, we see the word all and cringe, at least I do. All my heart, all my soul, all my mind, all my strength. I mean, that sounds like perfection to me. And how is that even possible? It isn't possible unless something happens to you to allow you to love God that way. God provided a way for you to love him back by giving his son, Jesus, to be the substitute on the cross of the curse or the outcome of sin. So God first loved us so that we could love him back. He made it possible for us to be transformed to be Christ-like, and Christ was perfect and without sin. Listen to this statement. What God forbids should never be done, and what God commands should always be done. Again, there's a lot of perfection in that sentence with the words never be and always be. But Pastor Adam, you say, I fall and fail, and I have to come back many times and say, I'm sorry and please forgive me. Yeah, I know, I do too. In the sense of perfection, of never falling from following God's law perfectly, I'm a failure, time and time again. But it is not following God's law that saves us. That would be doing something to earn salvation. We are saved by grace through faith. We receive salvation from God by a perfect Savior, Jesus Christ. I am perfect before God because of Him and His action on the cross and rising from the grave. So back to our question, how do I love God with all my heart, soul, mind, and strength? I do that perfectly by acknowledging my need of Him and to live for Him each and every day. There is not a day that I don't need Him. There is not a time when His words and ways don't apply to me. There is a living, even when I fail and fall, that I rise back up still in His hands. I say, I'm sorry, and please forgive me to my neighbor that I'm attempting to love as myself because of my relationship with God and how much I love him. I can only be perfect spiritually because of the one who is perfect made it so, and I get to live out that saved life loving God and others. A look ahead is at our annual Oglesby Union Church Summer Picnic on Sunday, August 27th. That's the last Sunday in August, and we'll be at the Lehigh Park in Oglesby. If you've been thinking about seeing what our church is all about, this is a great time to join us. We'll have an outside service under the pavilion at 1015, and then a meal together afterwards with plenty of food. We're praying for good weather so we can play some volleyball, bag toss, and frisbee and have the kids run around in the big grass field and enjoy the playground. Bring yourself, your family, and some comfortable lawn chairs for a morning at the park, Sunday, August 27th at 1015. Again, I'm Pastor Adam, and I invite you to join us this morning at 1015 at the Oglesby Union Church for another message from God's Word, the Bible. Visit our website at ouc.life, and may you receive the blessings of God as you live your life to the glory of Him. Join Pastor Adam this morning at Oglesby Union Church. They're right next to City Hall on Walnut Street, and their Sunday morning worship service starts at 1015. Oglesby Union Church's mission is to know Jesus, grow in Him, go where He leads, and show His love. Drink more of the living water from Jesus today at Oglesby Union Church and go down to the river again next Sunday morning at 825 on Classic Hits 1039 WLPL.